Hello guys, welcome back, welcome, welcome, welcome. It's been about a week, I know, since a new video has popped up. News has popped in since then. Anaheim elections have ended and a lot of measures have been passed and a Disney friendly council is now, um, um, yeah, Disney majority, Disney back can uh, council is now on the, um, the uh board here um we got um a disney backed mayor so <laughs> yep disney basically majority won the elections measures j and k which disney backed for passed with a large margin of over 10 percentage points or more the only one that disney lost was measure l and that narrowly passed basically just a few minutes Sorry, a few, like a few thousand, just a thousand, a few hundred to a thousand votes. Um, the yes vote won more than the no vote. So, um, that one is going to be a very contentious. There's a, both sides already have lawsuits planned, so that one could be back and forth in court for the next few months. But all the other one, all the other ones have passed. Yes, all the other ones have passed. Um with a big wide margin which is good disney has a majority again five i think it's five to two five people um are disney backed people the two are disney um anti-disney one of them being jose moreno leader of the unite here the hotel union group but um today's main topic here is about not very farm the i a a c a which is um theme park uh, convention is happening this week and um it's also a big time for announcements usually new trains we saw there's a new train you can the new train for the sea hmm, world's title twisters on display and other new rides as well and today also very farm took their time to announce or uh, decided to announce the um their new ride or really an overlay of a ride and a re overlay and rename of a ride it's called calico river rapids so ever since last year, it's rumored the Bigfoot Rapids would close this year for a major refurbishment to add animatronics and theming, more theming, and that has happened. But Bigfoot Rapids has been well underway for a refurbishment, been well under refurbishment over the past couple of months, actually. And no, everything's been mum about it. Then uh, Knott's Bay Farm released a teaser last week, or last couple of weeks ago. Um, Naming like Calico River Adventure, sent in the show The River. And then today, we got a new name and ride details Calico River Rapids, which is uh, the re theming of Bigfoot Rapids, is going to open about Memorial Day next year, Memorial Day next year, summer 2019. Same about the same time when uh, Jurassic World's going to open, and also as um, Galaxy's Edge. It's going to take the Bigfoot Rapids, and according to attractions.com, it's going to add new features to the attraction, including new animatronics, themed, so themed show scenes, a new story overlay, and dynamic water effects. If you go on attractions.com or at Orange County Register, there are some great renderings of the um, new ride. I'll try to, cover, try to post, there's more than just this cover photo here. There's about like three to five renderings of our concept art of the ride that um, the new ride and the animatronics and water effects. This pretty, looks pretty cool. Nice watercolor painting here. Calico River Rapids will take guests on a search for a new land on the outskirts of Calico, the themed area in the park's ghost town. Riders will travel through the authentic setting with the help of, tr of frontiersmen who have planned the path for settlers to explore. Rapids will encounter plenty of surprises along the way, like Roaring Rapids, Indigenous Wildlife, and Unique Homesteaders. Very excited to see how real these animatronics look, of the, specifically of the wildlife and the homesteaders as well. The circular raft ride vehicle will seat six passengers and travel through twists and turns, rushing waters, and rapids current, rapid currents as it navigates this unexplored river path. The attraction will come to life with new animatronics and special effects designed and manufactured by Garner Holt Productions. No specific opening has been revealed for this revamped attraction. And it says stay tuned to the website for more updates as they are announced. 
I'm guessing Memorial Day, because usually the day that's the unofficial start of summer, and usually when theme parks say like summer 2019, like Galaxy's Edge, summer 2019, but really planning to open in Memorial Day. And the summer doesn't start until June 21st, you know, kids get out of school, and again, a lot of barbecues, unofficial, it's got really, it gets really hot, especially in Anaheim, I play in a park, really hot, and by May, it could be already 90 degrees, so perfect time to open Memorial Day. And, um, again, some great concept art. You can go on attractions.com or if you just search up Calico River Rapids, the, all uh, the water, uh, water, um, watercolor concept art. Um, we'll have more details on this attraction as soon as places like attractions.com and Knott's Bay Farm Cedar Fair releases them. But for now, new, uh, new water ride or an overlay of a ride ride, new name. Adding some animatronics and adding some cool water effects. Hopefully, Disney does this with, with Grizzly River Run and California Adventure. The theme is fantastic. I think add uh, a, a more of a story and a maybe add like the country bears, the brother bears, brother bears, country bears just scattered throughout the attraction. That I feel like that'd be really awesome and really, really. Only plus, not downgrade, upgrade, not downgrade, Grizzly River Run. So hopefully Disney, take note. We can do this with uh, uh, Grizzly River Run next year. I'll be back later this week with the contest and more news. Have fun.